Today, we are going to be naming the ionic compound NH4I. Now, you might be saying, whoa, 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 Christina, how is this an ionic compound, right? I don't see any metals in here. We have nitrogen, hydrogen, and iodine, and those are all nonmetals. But however, if you see that you have three or more different elements, we do have three elements. We have nitrogen, hydrogen, and iodine. If you see that you have three or more elements, you know that you're dealing with at least one polyatomic ion. And if you have a polyatomic ion, it will be classified as an ionic compound. Now remember, polyatomic ions are never on the periodic table. You need to memorize them. So that's why I wrote down the polyatomic we're using here. So just use flashcards and try to memorize it, okay? NH4, which is always a plus one charge, is always called ammonium. And it's right here. Here's the NH4. So that's my polyatomic. And then the I, which is iodine, is the nonmetal component. Iodine is somewhere over here on the periodic table. It's a halogen, right? It's in group 7A or 17, and halogens are nonmetals. Now, all we have to do is just name it. The polyatomic comes first because it's literally the first one that's here, right? And that name always stays the same. That's why you have to memorize them. NH4 is ammonium, so I'm just going to write ammonium. And then comes the I for iodine, but the nonmetal always gets the IDE ending. So it was iodine, but now it's going to be iodide. I will get rid of the NE and I will just put a DE for the IDE. And that's it. Since there technically are no metals here, I don't have to worry about Roman numerals, right? The, the Roman numerals are only for transitional metals, so we don't have to worry about that. So this is it. NH4I is ammonium iodide. That's it, guys. Hopefully this helped. Let me know in the comments. Love talking to you guys. Hope you're all doing well now you're studying hard. Good luck on your tests and quizzes. And if you want, subscribe to the channel. That'll help us out. But even if not, or even if so, I'll see you guys in the next lesson. Take care. Bye-bye.